Here's how you can easily speed up or slow down your video with Clipchamp. Start by heading over to clipchamp.com and then log in or create your free account. I've put the link in the description below. Once logged in, you'll be taken to the homepage where you'll click on the create a new video button. Then you'll be taken straight into the editor. The first thing you'll need to do is import the videos you want to change the speed of. By navigating over to the import media button, selecting the assets and hitting open. They'll load into your media library over here. Now add the videos into the timeline by dragging and dropping them in just like this. Now that all of the videos are in the timeline, to edit the speed of one video clip, click on the asset in your timeline. It will highlight in green so that you know which one is selected. Then you'll navigate over to the property panel and click into the speed tab. Now using the speed selector here, drag the slider left to slow the clip down just like this, or drag it right to speed the clip up. You can choose between 0.1x all the way to 16x speed options. You can also import a specific value here in this box. Just type in the figure and then hit enter to action the change. Now when I hit playback, you can see the speed has changed and it will look something like this. I'll change the speed again and make the clip even faster and then it will look something like this. You'll need to note that by editing the speed of your clip, you'll also be editing the length of the asset in the timeline, as you can see here. The faster the speed, the shorter the video clip, and the longer the speed, the longer the video clip. Now, if you've changed the speed of your clip, some gaps may have appeared, which you'll need to delete. As you can see here, there's now a huge gap between my clips, and I'll need to delete that. Simply hover your cursor over the gap, and the gap removal button will appear. Click on the trash can icon and the gap will disappear. All of your other assets will then merge back together to keep a consistent flow. Next, to change the speed of multiple videos in your timeline at the same time, use our multi-item editing tool. To select multiple assets, simply hold down the shift key on your keyboard and click on the assets you want to change the speed of. Again, you'll notice they'll highlight in green so that you know which ones you've selected. If you want them all selected, just drag your cursor over all of the assets in the timeline, just like this, or you can hit the command A key on your keyboard. Once you've selected the assets, again, navigate over to the property panel and click into the speed tab. You'll follow the same steps as before by dragging the speed slider left or right to adjust the speed of all of your videos at the same time. Then just go ahead and delete any gaps that have been formed and it's as simple as that. Once you're completely happy with your video, export it by heading over to the export button, selecting your video quality, and then once the export is complete, hit save to your computer and it will download straight to your device, all ready for you to share. And that's how you can easily speed up or slow down a video with Clipchamp. If you like this video, don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel for our weekly how-to videos.